Baby? Oh my god, I've got baby fever. Hey YouTube, how are you doing? Today I am going to answer a question submitted by Quincy. He asked, do we, as in me and Rocky, ever see ourselves adopting kids? It's funny you should ask that question, Quincy, since I have been a little bit baby crazy lately, um, which is why I am entitling this video Baby Fever. Now, to answer the question just directly, yes. Rocky and I have talked about it before, um, and we are definitely not opposed to the idea. Rocky wants to have a little girl, and I want to have a little boy. Um, but honestly, I would be happy with a little girl, too. Um, I just think it'd be cool to have a boy that could take camping and backpacking with me and that kind of stuff. Now, on to the baby fever part. I have lots of friends, you know, they're all right around my age, you know, in their 30s, they are married and they have started to have kids. I'm talking straight people, of course, because I have a lot of straight friends. Um, and they're all, you know, married and they're having babies and they have kids and whatnot. My brother is married and he has kids and I play with my nephews all the time. But none of these people, none of these kids, none of this has ever given me baby fever before. And it's not until recently where I've started you know, I hung out with Debt Fox, Jay and Brian, and their family, and I've met them in person and stuff, that I've really somehow caught baby fever. And I don't know what it is. I think maybe it's the fact that even though all these people have kids around me, none of them are a model of what my family would be, meaning that I don't have any gay guy married friends with kids. They are the first couple, first gay guy couple that I know that actually has kids um, and that I'm hanging out with and I'm actually seeing that, you know, in real life, in person and maybe just seeing, you know, something that is more, you know, resembling of what my reality would be has, you know, just giving me the baby fever. So, I admit, I, I have, I've turned into a woman and I have the baby fever and I apologize for offending all women right there. But, um, Rocky and I have talked about it, and in our current situation, um, with, you know, the comic book store going out of business and kind of ruining our lives and everything, um, right now is not the time. We couldn't have a baby right now. Um, are we getting too old to have babies in the future? I don't know. I'm about to turn 34. Um, Rocky just turned 38. So, I mean, that's not too old. I mean, I don't think so. We could still do it. Um, Rocky's starting to think now that he is getting a bit old to have kids. But you never know. I mean, our situation could change. You know, things are a bit jacked up right now because of the comic book store and it taking us down with it. Um, also, if, for those of you that don't know, I've mentioned it briefly before, we live in a loft. So we don't have any bedrooms. I mean, we have the upstairs loft area which is all of our bedroom. It's just one giant room with a bathroom. And it's ginormous, by the way. I don't think we could ever leave and go to a normal sized bedroom. It'd be like impossible. And then we have the downstairs, you know, which is just one giant room, except for the kitchen and the bathroom. And basically there's no doors. I mean, the only doors that exist are on the two bathrooms and that's it. Um, so there's no place to have a kid. I mean, there's no, there's no other bedroom. I mean, there's no real first bedroom. It's just the loft, right? So I'm not sure where we would put a kid, and which means that we would have to move or something, which we're not also not in a position to move right now um, because this place is totally underwater thanks to the economy. So I don't know, there's a bunch of factors. You know, when you're gay and you're thinking about these things, you have more time to think about, you know, all the reasons why you can't do it or all that crap. You know, if you're straight, you can just go get tanked at a bar and knock someone up and then poof, you have a baby nine months later. It's a little bit harder for us. We have to go through all the plan of adopting a baby, or we have to go buy a baby, or go across the border to Mexico and take a baby. I don't know. All those different scenarios are possible, I suppose. So that is where it stands right now, Quincy. Yes, we have talked about it. Um, I, 
admit I, I would like to be a dad. I admit it. Um, right now is not the time. So who's to say what it'll be like in the future? Maybe in the future it will be the time. And maybe we will do that. That's it. Um, if any of you guys out there have any more questions for me, feel free to ask them in the comments below. You can message me directly here on YouTube. You can send me a tweet at, at AggiePM. Um, multiple ways to get a hold of me and ask me questions. And I get enough questions, you know, I can make a, you know, long video answering multiple questions. Um, and Jay, no more answering me stupid questions. Real questions. Okay, till next time, YouTube. Love and bubbles.